You just said that Mr. Prigozhin is referred to as Putin's chef. Indeed, that is his job. He is a restaurant owner in St. Petersburg. But do you really think that a person who is in the restaurant business, even if this person has some hacking opportunities and owns a private firm in this field, could use it to sway elections in the United States or a European country? Could it be that the media and political standards in Western countries have reached such a low level that a Russian restaurant owner can sway voters in a European country or the United States? Isn't that ridiculous? There is such a person in the United States, Mr. Soros, who interferes in affairs all over the world. I often hear from my American friends that America as a state has nothing to do with his activities. There are rumors circulating now that Mr. Soros is planning to make the euro highly volatile. Experts are already discussing this. Ask the State Department why he is doing this. The State Department will say that it has nothing to do with these activities. Rather, it is Mr. Soros' private affair. With us, it is Mr. Prigozhin's private affair. This is my answer. Are you satisfied with it?